Cases of whooping cough are on the rise in Quebec and pre-teens are most affected. Whooping cough normally comes in waves every two to five years. The last one was in 2019 before the pandemic with more than 1,200 cases. But this wave is much bigger, more than 14,000 cases in Quebec so far this year. And a third of those are in children aged 10 to 14. Newborns and infants are the ones most at risk of severe complications. And that's why vaccination programs traditionally target expectant mothers or children aged zero to six. So why are kids aged 10 to 14 most affected now? Vaccination is a great modality to hope to prevent it. Unfortunately, however, there is not long lasting immunity from vaccination nor from even having had the disease. The pandemic, of course, threw a wrench in everything. There was some delays in vaccination. So it appears whooping cough is catching up with kids who might have missed a scheduled vaccination or booster during the pandemic. Cases have actually been declining slightly over the last five weeks, but that could change now that most children are back in school. And that's why provincial public health officials sent a letter to schools and parents last week asking them to be on the lookout for the telltale symptom. There's this staccato cough that has a very typical sound. So it's cough, 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 which is the whoop, giving the name of the whooping cough. Whooping cough usually isn't dangerous for older children and adults, but it's not that much fun either. Cough, 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 and it goes on and on until they may throw up. And then there is the convalescent phase where people are getting better, less contagious, but the cough can last for three or more months. In adolescents and adults, it can give you rib fractures, muscle injury in the chest from the persistent cough. Older children can still get the vaccine, but it's not covered by the province over six years of age, so parents would have to pay out of pocket. Otherwise, whooping cough can be treated with antibiotics.